Welcome Scorpios, I'm back with another video for the month of August. These are general reads, so they will not resonate with every single Scorpio. So if it happens to resonate with you, then great, this was your story. If not, you can simply check out your moon or your rising videos. You may get um, some insight there. You can also book your very own personal reading with the Empress. That information is going to be in the drop box below. As well, guys, you can check out my merch. It's below the video, guys. If you want to donate to the channel, that information is in the drop box below as well. If you would like to join on, join in on our money train ritual, guys, um, you can contact me via email and I can give you details on how to join. All right, so let's see what we got, guys. If you're new, go ahead and click the bell. You don't want to miss out on future videos. Okay, so this is going to be for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. And it's going to be for the month of August. So let's see what we get for Scorpios. Scorpio. Scorpio, what messages are there for my Scorpios? We got the Eight of Pentacles. All right, Eight of Pentacles. Eight of Pentacles is work being put in, progress being made. We got the Seven of Cups. Are you trying to make a decision? Let's see. Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio. Queen of Swords at the bottom of the deck. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Energy. Well, let's see what we got. The Knight of Cups. Five of Pentacles, Two of Cups, Five of Cups, I feel like you're trying to progress, you're trying to move forward, um, Some of you feel uh, left out in the cold or rejected or alone. Um, I'm getting an invitation here with the Knight of Cups. Two of Cups. Like, yeah, like there's togetherness in the past. But then we got the Five of Pentacles, which is, you know, feelings of being left out. Um, five of Cups is regrets and, you know, kind of like crying over spilled milk. Um, your energy being the chariot card, you're trying to move forward. You're trying to progress. Um, some of you are throwing yourselves into work, but I'm getting like some of y'all feel heartbroken or sad about something. I'm getting like sad or down or depressed energy here. So let me see what we, what we get here. Why is the eight of pentacles here? Yeah, you're trying to keep busy with the two of pentacles, four of pentacles, queen of pentacles. Yeah, like your focus is possibly like you're throwing yourself into work. You're trying to stay busy. What's the knight of cups? Some of y'all are trying to keep up with this image that you're busy. Why's the knight of cups here? The moon. Cancer and Pisces is energy. We got you guys' this energy here with the tower. Why's the moon card here? Okay, so you're waiting on an invitation. You're waiting on an invitation from possibly like a Cancer or a Pisces um, or like a nightcap. I'm getting like, um, you're waiting on some type of invitation. Why's the two of pentacles here? Yeah, you're wanting to keep something going. 
Okay, so you're trying to keep something going. Why is the Seven of Cups here? Knight of Pentacles. Okay, so you feel like someone is slow to give you an answer or make up their mind on a decision. Why is the Five of Pentacles? Six of Cups. Yeah, like... You have, like, bad memories of the past. I got the Eight of Cups, the Eight of Wands, the Temperance. Why is the Six of Cups here? And the Three of Cups, yeah. Like, you feel left out. Like, you feel like you don't fit in uh, with us, with a group of people. Or with a certain group, or you feel like you don't, you feel left out by your friends because maybe you were waiting for somebody to invite you, um, invite you in on something. Why is the two of cups here? You may feel like you rushed into a relationship, or you rushed out of a relationship. I see a final decision being made, or a wake up call, or realizing. Um, that you rush to be in a relationship. Because I got the Two of Cups and the Knight of Swords. I'm getting like very aggressive type energy. Like either running to or running from. Um, somebody has issues with being alone. Okay. Five of Swords and Eight of Cups. Five of Swords and the Eight of Cups. Why is the Judgment card here? page of pentacles yeah like you don't want to say you don't want to say it but some of y'all are like wanting to be single I feel like some of y'all feel like you rushed into a relationship I got the hermit and the nine of pentacles definitely single person okay definitely single energy but you don't want you didn't want to say it you don't want to tell this person that. I want the four of cups here. Nine of swords. Yeah, like queen of cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. You're not sure. I'm getting Capricorn's energy here too. Um... We got the devil and the king of pentacles, two of swords, queen of cups, nine of swords. Like you're worrying about something. Like you feel like anxious or anxiety. Why is the nine of swords here? Oh, six of wands. So you wanted some attention, but you didn't want to tell this person. Okay, well, maybe you just wanted. Maybe some of you feel like you rushed um, into a relationship but, and others feel as if you didn't want to tell this person. But I feel like you wanted to be close. You want to be close. You want to get close with this person. You want to cuddle. You want to be like together. Because I'm getting a sense of like you feel left out and rejected. Like you don't feel like you fit in with a certain group. Um, you're waiting for some type of invitation. I'm seeing that as well too, but why do you, what, five of cups is for your future energy? Like, why is the five of cups here? The ten of swords. You regret ending something. Yeah, the tower. You guys, this energy. You regret ending something, and something could possibly like just it could have ended abruptly. Queen of Pentacles, four of Pentacles, um. You may feel like you could have, you should have withheld something that you said. Why is the tower card here? The Empress. I'm feeling like somebody said that they needed some space. The chariot card is Cancer's energy. 
okay? But I'm getting like, you're trying to move forward. You're trying to move past that. Yeah, see, some of y'all want to be single. Nine of Pentacles. Some of y'all feel like y'all better off by yourself when you're focusing on yourself. You may keep an eye on this person. But you're, you're kind of like waiting for this to balance out. I got the Justice card here. You're kind of like waiting for uh, things to balance out. But you possibly like keep your eye on this person. But I feel like some of y'all are like focused on yourself or focused on your well-being. I have the Nine of Pentacles here. Page of Wands. Ten of Wands. In the cups. I'm really picking up on Cancer's energy. But you feel burdened. Like, you feel um, burdened by the situation. And you may feel like you just need to be alone or need some space. How they're viewing you is the four swords. So, yeah, some of y'all are on, like, a, a break period, okay? Like, y'all taking a break from each other. Why is the four swords here? The five of wands. Yeah. Some someone here is tired of um the disagreements or arguing. Um they want some fresh new energy. They want to close this chapter behind and they want some fresh new energy. Why is the five of wands here? Nine of Wands and the Strength card. They could be avoiding you. To try to stay strong. Um, with the three of pentacles. I feel like you've been throwing yourself into work. I'm also seeing like someone got kicked out of a group. Like you fear that you're no longer a part of a group here. With the three of pentacles and the seven of wands. Like yeah. Like some of y'all are feeling like very. We got the high priestess and the hermit. Like this is doing some soul searching. Like you feel. Some of y'all feel like alone. I'm getting like an alone feeling, like like you're by yourself. We got the three of swords as the outcome. So this is heartache or pain or a split, a breakup, a divorce. We got the star card. Okay, so you're hoping for some changes. Okay, yeah, like you're, you're looking for some changes you're for, with your emotions. Like you're, I feel like some of you guys are feeling a little down emotionally. Okay. Um, some of y'all are focused on your finances with the king of pentacles, justice. Yeah, like you're trying to balance out your finances. Why is the star card here? Yeah, eight of cups. Eight of cups. Eight of cups. You're scared to say something. Or scared to ask this person something. Ooh, I got a ooh, I got a sneaky. So y'all being kind of sneaky, the devil and the seven of swords. Yeah, very sneaky energy. Maybe you're hoping somebody will leave, but you're scared to ask. Scared to ask them to leave. Scared to tell them that you want them to leave. Lots of page of cups here. Ten of Cups, Queen of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, Queen, King of Swords, yeah, like, what's the King of Swords here, the Magician. Maybe it's sad because you have to leave. Um, or you feel like you need to leave. But you're kind of like afraid to 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 tell this person that you want to leave. Um, because I feel like with the Ten of Cups, this is supposed to be like a happy, um, you know, like maybe you've been with this person for a while. 
and everybody is expecting for you to, for you know you've been happy with this person for a while um but i'm getting like a cutoff king of swords and the magician yeah in the world i'm getting a cutoff Yeah, you've been holding back. The, you've been holding this back for a long time. You've been wanting to say this for a long time. And I'm getting that somebody plays a lot. Like, somebody is a player. Um, the Knight of Wands and the Sun. Somebody just does things for fun or is just running around playing for fun. I'm getting also that someone could be married here with the Four of Wands and the King of Pentacles. I'm getting like a husband energy. But I feel like you've been withholding, you've been withholding this. You've been wanting to say this for a while, but you just haven't. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section. Let me know what's going on in the comment section below. And I'm going to chat with y'all later.